What's up guys, my name is Brendan and today I'm going to give you an introduction to groundwork, teach you front sweep and back sweep and one final move called the pocket knife. First I'm going to be going over the front sweep. Now all a front sweep is is a grounded round kick. So we're going to start in a backside stance. From there we're going to squat down to the ground as low as we can. Next we're going to emulate hip turnover and how we're going to do that is we're going to fall to our left side. I like to put my left knee on the ground, you don't have to put your knee on the ground but you do need to put your left hand on the ground to support you as you do that fall. And turning your body as you do that fall is what's gonna give you a hip turnover when you do that front sweep. Now after you kick that leg all the way past your target, you're just gonna keep your momentum going, push hard off the ground using that support arm. For me, it's my left arm because I'm kicking with my right leg. Now after I push off the ground, I'm just gonna stand right back up where I started. A front sweep starts and ends in a backside stance. Next, I want to go over back sweep. And all back sweep is, is a grounded hook kick. We're going to start in a front side stance. And from there, we're going to squat down to the ground as low as we can, fall to our left, and use our right hand as a support. We're going to turn our hips to the side to get that hip turnover, and then drag our leg from right to left, going all the way past our target. And after we go past our target, we're gonna align our hips back up to neutral and then stand right back up in front side. A back sweep starts and ends in front side stance. Last thing I wanna leave you guys with is a trick called the pocket knife. If a front sweep is a grounded round kick and a back sweep is a grounded hook kick, the pocket knife is a grounded jack knife. You're gonna go into your front sweep, but after your leg passes your target, you're gonna do a quick turn of the body, a quick 180 degree spin on the ground and then throw the hook kick. It's a really fun, unique skill that shows diversity, which is really good if you wanna impress other people or be a battle tricker. Diversity is really important and groundwork is a great way to show that you have all the high tricks and the low tricks. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you wanna recommend the next tutorial, leave it in the comments down below. And if you guys wanna get any trick in clothing, any of the clothing that I'm wearing, please go to howtomastertricking.com slash masterathleticwear and that's where you'll be able to pick all of that up. As a thank you for you guys supporting me, if you order between now and November 7th, you'll be getting a free, super high quality metallic mastering logo sticker as a thank you. You guys have been supporting me since day one and it means the world to me that I have this community that is willing to learn and willing to give back. Now, speaking of giving back, I wanna say a huge thank you to all the patrons who have been supporting this series. If you guys didn't know, it's them who originally donated the money that allowed me to get the camera, that allowed me to up the production quality of the tutorials, and they're only getting better. Thank you guys so much, and have a lovely day.